Hello, I'm gonna talk to you about this. Detroit on fire. Now this comes from Carrie Ann Gittin. This is a prophecy from Carrie Ann Gittin. She says she's looked at the window, saw the curtain, and immediately she comes to an open vision. She said, Detroit is on fire, okay? And at least half of it's going to burn. Now, she didn't say when this is going to happen. Is it going to happen at 5 o'clock today because it's about 12 noon now? Is it going to happen at 5 o'clock today? Is it going to happen two, two days from now? Is it going to happen at 7 o'clock in the evening, 7 o'clock in the morning? Is it going to happen uh, in August or January the 1st, 2024? She didn't say. So she don't know and I don't know. But she did say Detroit is on fire, y'all. What you expect? Of course it's going to be on fire. You got these concentrated blacks down there. Most of them are poor. And concentrated lawlessness. Of course, some fool is going to take a, a torch, go find a gas line, and blow up everybody. Of course that's going to happen. What you expect? You got concentrated blacks up there, which is, a, which is bad. And you got concentrated lawlessness. You got the blacks killing the blacks every day, all day. Uh, the young people doing nothing but going to jail, also known as summer camp, okay? You got the young people carjacking, thieves, robbery, robbing the old people, robbing the young people, killing children that are just outside playing. That's what you got in Detroit. What you expect to happen? Of course, it's going to blow up one day. And of course, it's going to burn, baby. It's going to burn. Burn, baby, burn. Of course. That's what's going to happen. What you expect? Now, uh, you know, of course it's going to happen. That should be is no surprise, but really, are, is the fire department going to co go into gang territory? Okay, is it? Is the fire department going to go into gang territory? Hmm. Okay, but look, let's just say that one half of the city burns. It's going to be more like one half of the city burns. Look, it's going to be some ratchet black, mer black women that's going to give birth to more killers more thieves, they're going to rob Walgreens, CBS, etc. It's going to be more wretched black women that's going to give birth to more pimps. They're going to give birth to more carjackers. And this cycle will continue for the next 50 years. Detroit is going to be Detroit for the next 50 years. Because you got concentrated blacks, concentrated poverty, concentrated lawlessness. What you expect to happen? It's just doom. It's going to be like this for the next 50 years. Okay, so don't even be surprised. So if you don't want to be caught up into all this, whether it's going to burn or it's good, it's getting worse. Uh, leave. There's 50 states dispersed now. I su I'm suggesting to all black people, if you want your child to have a chance in life to get out of that city, there are 50 states. Okay, but look, that that would be no surprise to anybody if Detroit burned. <laughs> I don't think anybody would be shocked. Okay, have a nice day.